All right, since I'm just sitting here in my car, I figure I might as well show you what some of the shit on the screen means. Um, hang on, I'm gonna turn off my heat. Seeing as it's minus 20 here in the great white fucking north. Um, your RPM manifold vacuum, so you wanna make sure your vacuum, when you're at idle, um, your vacuum should be around 18 and a half inches of mercury, so that way you know it's good. Um, your coolant temp, um, basically when it's below 170, the computer is just uh, running off of the predefined tables. Once it gets above 170 is when it actually starts um, reading off of the oxygen sensor and adjusting the table. So right now mine's still warming up, it's been warming up for a while because like I said, it's minus fucking 20. Um, you have your target air fuel, so you can dial that in a little bit. By default, the target is 13.9. I lean mine out a little bit to 14.1 because these engines do tend to like uh, running a little bit leaner. Um, your air fuel trim, I recently did a reset on mine. So what that is, is that's gonna be the computer telling, or the auction sensor detecting how inaccurate the table is. So that lean is kind of a long-term adjust. Trim is kind of like an instantaneous adjust. Um, obviously my fan's off, my throttle position sensor's at zero because I'm not touching the gas pedal. Um, there's my target RPM, 684, because it's almost warmed up. My target is set at 680. Your IAC steps and learn. Um, like I said, I reset my computer. So what'll happen is your IAC steps should be between three and 10 when it's warmed up and at idle and your HVAC and everything is off and your fan's not running. So under normal idle conditions in park, you should be between three and 10. That IAC learn, that's how, uh, that means it's still kind of dialing it in a little bit. So it'll start out at like 255, work its way down to zero. As it approaches zero, means it's essentially done learning. Um, the PID is kind of the direction it's going, whether the learn is going up or down. Um, there's your battery, so that way you know it's charging. Uh, run state, right now I'm at idle. Uh, when the car is off, it'll say stall. Uh, when you're cranking, it'll say crank, and then when you touch the gas, it'll say dash, because uh, it's dashing, yeah. And then tail is when you let off and as a re-approaching idle. So if you find, when you do finally go to fire it up, if it just says um, idle or it says stall, uh, and it doesn't say crank while you're trying to crank it, it means that the uh, tack wire, which is the negative on the coil, is hooked up wrong. Uh, and that's about the nuts and bolts of it.